Hey everyone, thanks for joining us. I'm Dan, this is Cody, we're from Cracked. We're gonna do a weekly recap show of Game of Thrones. And we're gonna talk about the premiere. You, do you see it? I did. Yeah. It felt like the whole episode was previously on Game of Thrones. Do you remember uh, when Marcella died? Here is Jamie telling Cersei that that happened. Right. Do you remember when Daenerys got captured by the Throcky Horde? Here that is still happening. Remember when Jon Snow died? Here's Jon Snow, dead in the snow. Yeah, they pick him up, they the guy, move him. They move him, and the guy who killed him said, I killed him, and I'm fine with it. Right. And everyone's like, <laughs> Okay. All right. <laughs> so Sansa and Theon escaped. They did this big dramatic thing, like, we have to jump off the castle, and then we have to walk in this frozen water. And Sansa's like, I don't, it's too cold. Like, you have to. It's the only way to stop the dogs. So they walk across and they the road, do. and then the dogs are, like, waiting for them on the other side. <laughs> right, it buys them a minute to hug. And then they're saved by Bran and Pod. Yeah, and then she's like, I pledge my sword to you again. Clearly I've shown my worth. And, like, why even wait for a response? Yeah. Yes, we're all in it together now. <laughs> Those dogs, um, completely f***ed off, by the way. The sound was dogs barking the entire time. That's what gave attention. And then the dogs showed up, and they're still barking. And then Brienne and Pod showed up, and not only do the dogs not make an impact in that fight, these uh, historically vicious dogs that tear people apart, they just saw <laughs> Brienne and they were like, oh, that's Valyrian steel, holy shit, I'm gonna sit and, <laughs> and they watch the fun fight. <laughs> oh, Pod's finally fighting, all right, cool. <laughs> it's the, that time of the episode, everyone. It's the, the it's, it's the, the Dorn Corner. Dor I don't think we need to rethink that name. They killed Prince Duran. Obra took her tiny little knife and put it in, Ario Hota's giant back, and he instantly died. It really seems like this is D.B. Weiss and David Benioff's way of being like, we f***ing hated Dorne, and we only did it because George R. R. Martin made it. Because now that the shadow of Martin is gone, they wiped out everyone in Dorne. Prince Tristane is just f***ing painting eyeballs on rocks. I'm really sad that my betrothed is dead, and now I have to live in Smelly King's Landing. Oh, my sisters, that's weird. Oh, they're here to kill me. All right, I'm gonna pick the weaker That's one. That's also weird. And then turn my back on the stronger one. And that rounds out the Dorn Corner. The Dorn corner. corner. So Jon Snow's dead, huh? I guess. They stabbed him a bunch, and then they walked away. What does anybody want to do with the body? Like, they're making a, they're making a big thing over it. It's, it's clearly gonna become a plot point that Sir Davos Seaworth, the Onion Knight, uh, Dollar is dead, and the other f***ing five f nuts, they're gonna guard the body from Alistair, Thorn, and the other baddies. Burn the body. Right. We should right. all want to burn the body because it's gonna, otherwise it's gonna come back and then you have an undead Jon Snow in a bad way. Red Woman, that was one of the only things that was kind of new that happened in this episode, revealing that she's actually an old naked witch. Really rock bottom for her. That she and used to be like, aid to the king, the future king that she saw in the flames, and now she's like, I'm just like old and sad and tired of the wall. This <laughs> right, sucks. I'm here. I really want all of the Good Night's Watch guys to rally and go into a room like, Melisandre, we need you. Oh, shit. Okay, you're, oh, you're doing a thing. We get, we, we'll, we'll come, come back. back. You want to talk about Daenerys for a while? I guess, yeah. So she's with the new uh, Cal, Cal Moro. That whole scene felt like it was from Xena. They had that like, oh, is there anything better than seeing a naked woman for the first time? And the guy's like, Ah, sack in a city, sandwiches. He like rolls his eyes and like, seeing a naked woman is in the top five of things a person can do. And they're all like, yeah, that's fair. Like, yeah, that's Chandler's a really, right. really, right. <laughs> Especially Dithraki. Yeah. Doing bits. No, you don't do bits. Yeah. You raping, you pillage. Even when they talked in season one, there wasn't anything flowery about it or anything clever about it. It was like, we don't even call the ocean. It's just like poisoned grass that horses can't drink. <laughs> Tyrion and Varys walking around, and Varys is already getting his birds. That was another, like, joke thing inserted into the show, that he's it. like, I'd like to give you, uh, some money. Baby, for the, eat! For the, for the food, for the baby, and Varys is like, she thinks you're trying to eat her baby. They're like, waka waka, good joke. And then somehow, the entire fleet was on fire. Peter Dinklage practically directed camera, was like, well, we won't be sailing to Westeros anytime soon. It's like, whoa, f you! The show doesn't know what I want. It thinks I want to watch Arya get the shit kicked out of her. <laughs> and like, she's never had an easy life. Now she's blind and like, not even begging, just holding a bowl and being blind. My and then the wave God. shows up. It's like, you're still not doing this right <laughs> somehow. <laughs> she's just like, what are you doing? <laughs> you guys know how the show works. It's prediction time. The, and then the theme roll is the, for the for, for time of the card. Game of Thrones. So what do you think is gonna happen 
next. Mall Sunder's gonna walk out, and everyone's gonna be like, oh, what? <laughs> Do you have any predictions for Sansa and Theon? No, but I'm looking forward to their adventures, because now they're safe. Brienne has let a bunch of the people that she swore to protect are pretty dead. I know, I know. But I look forward to seeing post reek Theon a little bit, because we haven't seen that yet. Yeah. We've just seen him be like, we gotta go, and then they jump. We gotta go I'd in like the river. I'd like to see him gotta... be not sad for a while. Yeah. Because I've seen him be sad for so long. <laughs> Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching. Uh, we want uh, to make this review show kind of interactive. So today we've had predictions and the Dorn Corner. Uh, let us know in the comments some other segments, other unplanned segments that you want us to do. It can be, I'd like you to talk about Dollars Ed every week. Or just name a segment. Just say fucking Drogon's Alley and we'll make that a segment. The Marine we'll, things. Yeah, we'll, we'll check in with that. Yeah.